by an advancing buffalo soldier from the hanginess tree south of the Mason-Dixon line during their advance south at the time of the great war between the states. What is time the military was spent dancing and singing the made-up folk songs and trying to keep the morale of the soldiers up, their laughter and joy during the dark time of our young nation made the death and destruction just slightly more bearable. Woody almost made it through the war unscathed, but a hunk of shrapnel crushed his ankle leaving Woody with a limp that would follow him through life. Eventually, the war was won, and Woody headed home with his maker to start a life and work his 40 acres. Life was good as it could get. Up with the sun, living off the fat of the land, a free man. Woody and his maker would sit on the porch and entertain the family with his rousing rendition of What the little baby loves short and short and My little baby loves a short and bread Mama's little baby loves a short and short and Mama's little baby loves a short and bread Mama's little baby loves a short and short and Mama's little baby loves a short and short and Mama's little baby loves a short and short and Mama's little baby loves a short and like his contemporaries, Soft Shoe Slappy and Fast Step Festus. Everyone laughed at Woody as they would hoot, You know what, Ash can't dance? <laughs> Eventually, Woody's maker passed on. Woody stuck around the farm and entertained the family for years. But life on the farm gets boring for a young man in a brave new world full of opportunities and wonder. It was then Woody moved north to the big city. Being a country bumpkin in the big city, Woody eventually fell in with the wrong crowd. Woody got work at a speakeasy, started by cleaning up, but eventually with his good work habits and love of show, Woody fell in cahoots with the master distiller of the bathtub Janet at speakeasy. Life was good. But the demons of Woody's youth were slowly creeping back into his memory. It was a fateful night when Woody fell into a tub of gin and realized Alcohol could block out his terrible memories and loosen up his joints a bit to let him dance like he used to. The demons were at bay, and the patrons of the speakeasy loved Woody's blend of spirits and dance. This was before anyone knew the effects of Woody's lead paint.
possibly roll on. Prohibition, the Great Crash, the Dust Bowl, and the Migration West. Woody saw many things, good and bad, from new inventions to horrible injustices to man. Woody finally settled on the West Coast, picking vegetables and entertaining people in the work camps. He resided there for many years, living the quiet life in a box of forgotten memories in the attic of a broke-down palace. Till one night, he was found by a couple of industrious chemists looking for a place to set up their lab. Once again, Woody fell in with the wrong people. Take top, cookie shoes and flip flops, cheap crap. 
those big daddy fryers and crap. Thanks you. 